Greetings, Earthlings. I am still reeling about the conversation that we had before bed last night about creating a fat hat and an ass hat, and they would be fantastic. <laughs> it's Liam Mouse Vlog, Liam Mouse Vlog, it's Liam Mouse's Vlog. Today we are meandering around doing whatnot and thus forth and here far and there with and other words that don't make any sense. About to wash the Jeep. Uh, with my mind. He's a Jedi. Well, and yeah, I know, I saw the bee, I saw the bee. We don't want another bee incident, God forbid. I, in my defense, I'm semi allergic to bees and I really don't. My dad was so highly allergic and I don't know my level of allergency. That's not a word I know, but I don't give a shit. But I don't know how allergic I am, so I'm not trying to find out by getting stuck. Car wash. Looking at the car wash. Come on, baby, sing it with me, car wash. Oh. Get the hell out of the car. <laughs> It's like being on a ferry boat. It's the scramping of the mists and stuff. Yes, scramp. Scramp! Oh, it's so fancy and pretty. It's so pretty. BV Vanna, model your beautiful Jeep. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> about body hair and why it exists he's like why do you have nose hair and I was like well you know it's to he's like it's not even hair like well, it will protect it you purpose, it serves yeah. a purpose I said all hair on your body serves a purpose like your eyebrows for example are biologically on your body to keep sweat and stuff from running into your eyes it catches debris and sweat and things to protect your eyes and I went on to say you know the same goes for genitalia hair how it protects your reproductive organs and he's like how the hell do pubes protect my balls? Like, if I get kicked in the balls, hair is not gonna protect it very much. It's funny. Well, they're not. My balls are hairy. They're not gonna protect me when I get struck in them. Like, I'm sorry, but they don't provide that much cushion. Like, it's still gonna hurt. So we're talking about caveman days and how, how you know, maybe like bugs and parasites and things they had to deal with. You know, more genitalia hair might protect their reproductive organs more. And uh, you said something about big, nasty, sweaty, hairy balls. <laughs> yeah, I said back then they didn't really wash, so I guess if the balls were like sweaty and really hairy and smelly, then maybe bugs didn't want to come near them. But other than that, it ain't really gonna help. Theological discussions on pubic hair. This is what we do. We're getting Captain Fuzzy a haircut. However, it's gonna go. Mr. Fuzzy got his hair cut. Yes, I did. Feels great! <laughs> so we're at this little thingy in downtown Worcester. It's like an Oktoberfest thing. Worcester Fest. Worcester Fest or something. And 
There's some stuff and some things and I've never been to this before because it's always the same weekend as Swiss Festival and I always go to Swiss Festival, which is going on right now, but we didn't feel like driving all the way over there today. We're going tomorrow. So we're here. And I don't really even know what there is to do, but I'm sure we'll figure something out. Tacos! And another one gone, and another one gone, and another one Bob's famous, almost famous barbecue team. See how he ignores me? Doesn't play along. Just sees barbecue and... Ooh, cool. Oh, this is for that. Should I talk about the haunted house? I hear Worcester. I didn't know about it. Yeah, go from last year. Coupon's good for uh, three bucks off. Oh, wow. Where is it? Here's a map right here. Oh. Down by... Uh, Portage Road. Yeah, right down by Kmart. So there's all these classic cars. Here's an old hearse. That's cool. That's awesome. Makes me think of Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. That Bel Air though, that Bel Air is sweet. I have a weakness for Bel Airs. I wanted away from Derek because he just wanted to stand there and talk about like car crap with the sprint car guy. And it's boring for me to just stand there and listen to that, so I wandered off. He's probably still inspecting the vehicle with him right now. Probably didn't even notice I was gone, to be honest. Now we're taking a risk and playing the Ohio Lotto. We got the Walking Dead ticket. And I didn't win anything. An eight, okay, I fucking suck at life. All right, whatever. We didn't win anything. <laughs> we are pulling out of the parking lot and Derek just randomly was being Derek and he was just like, ding dong, away! And I said, yes, ding dong, away. And he was like, that sounds like uh, a spray or something. So I was like, does your penis ever get in the way? Do you randomly sit on it at inconvenient times? Does it just bug you? Try Ding Dong Away. Now in convenient spray bottle. Just spritz a little on your dick and it will shrivel up into nothingness. Effective for up to four to six hours. Consult a physician before use. I said that sounds very unpleasant and not fun. Very painful. I don't know. It's safe. Made of organic substances. Oh, all right. That's all it is. It's ice cold water in a spray bottle. Oh, Alright. <laughs> it's environmentally friendly and it gets your dick out of the way for a little bit. Perfect. came to see us. Hi guys. They're both very hungry. We bought some cat food last week because they come over. They don't really have a home. They're just kind of living under one of these houses or something. And we see them every once in a while and they're they like us now. They were skittish at first but now they're now they're our little friends. So that they can eat and be happy. Oh my goodness. He came over and he's trying to eat their her food now. She, 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 she. I'm just gonna give them the rest of your dishoney water. Okay, that's fine. Oh, sweet little poopy. They used I like to like little brown spot on her head. I know it's cute. They used to not let us uh, pet them or anything. They used to be scared of us, but now they just like they let us hold them. Yeah, and... come right over to us. <laughs> <laughs> They're so cute. I'm not trying to have another bee incident. No, you stay out of the cat food, you asshole. Well, don't piss it off. Oh no, it's down in the cat food. It's down in the cat food. Just hold on. Don't move, did... move, move. Get it back away. I hate you. You're gonna scare the cats. Yeah, <laughs> bitch, get on the roof. <laughs> Take the shoe up your asshole. 
You're such a pleasant human being sometimes. Nom 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 nom. Oh, you was near. Hey, she's a little foot. You're so cute. You're so hungry. <laughs> You're so small. Oh, you're so sweet. That one's my favorite right there. She looks like Mocha. Oh, she yawned. <laughs> and this here is Derek's favorite, the little gray one. I'm going to name her Alistair. <laughs> and then, of course, I said, well, would it be weird if I named that one Castiel? <laughs> That's very ladylike. <laughs> hey! Popping, so that's a computer. Right. Aww, look at him. Uh -huh. Oh, she matches your shirt. Oh, she has her paw stretched out. You guys are so sweet. Hmm. You guys are cute. Oh. Don't you cry.